Let's turn on the TV. Yeah. Let's see what's going on. This just in, in the town that you live in and are watching this channel station on, there was a robbery around the um, summer fun apartment. So you guys should better be careful and make sure your doors and windows are locked. I heard the robbery was very bad. They stole the TV, radio, luggage, pretty much anything they could find, jewelry, cameras, like I said, pretty much anything they could find that they thought was worth value. Please, I warn you to lock your doors and windows and double check that they are locked and of course, you know, don't want any of those robbers getting in. Thank you very much. This is Mary from um, your local news. Oh my gosh, that's awful. Yeah, I wonder who it was. Hopefully not my sister. Yeah, you should call her and find out. I definitely am. I hope she is not the one that got robbed because I know she has a camera like I and luggage. I know she keeps that stuff in her room for a fact. And um, so I just hope it wasn't her. Yeah, and I'll definitely make sure our windows and doors are locked. Yeah, especially when it's almost time to go to bed anyway. We just better be really careful. Yeah, we really should. Shh, guys, it's ringing. Hey, Allie. Oh, hey, Nicole. What's going on? Not much. Did you see the news today, like, just now? No, we didn't. Why? What happened? Somebody in our apartment building got robbed. I was wondering if it was you. It's so awful. They said to definitely double check that your doors are and windows are locked tonight. I And we are definitely doing that. Oh, my gosh, that's awful. It was, it was not us, luckily, and um, I'm guessing it wasn't you either. So, um, yeah, I'm definitely going to make sure we have our doors and windows locked, too. That is so awful. Oh, I know. And, yeah, it wasn't me. Well, I just was calling to check in to see if it was you. I'm very relieved that it wasn't you. So, that's really all I wanted to say. So, um, hopefully we're all safe tonight and they don't come back. Love you, sis. Bye. Yeah, I'm hoping the same. Love you, too. Bye. All right, so it wasn't my sister. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Um, do we know anyone else in the building? Yeah, remember, um, uh, duh, my best friend. And mine! Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll definitely call them. Alright. I just got off the phone with them. Yeah, what'd they say? It wasn't them, luckily. Yeah, so it must be someone else in the building we don't know. Yeah, those are really the only families we're pretty close with. Yeah. <sighs> well, that's a relief. But that's just so awful. I know. All right, I'm going to, like, double check that the doors are locked. And um, then we will just head off to bed, I guess. Yeah. Oh, I'm really nervous to go to bed. Yeah. We should have somebody stay guard all night and switch off shifts. Yeah, Dad, that's not a bad idea. No one wants to stay up and all night and just walk and like make sure no one comes in yeah we'll be fine i'm sure the security like here is going to be double locking all our their doors and windows too yeah we're fine kids it'll be okay all right in bed in bed in bed hey how come you guys aren't in bed dad we're just scared to sleep out there you know they could like just come and like see us there and I don't know what they could do. So you don't want to sleep out there? No. Do you want me to bring your bed in? Yes, please. We should probably take that stuff in too. Like, mom keeps her purse out here. We should probably bring all this stuff in. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, it's a lot more cluttered now, but do you guys feel safer? Yeah, definitely. Thanks, Dad. No problem. All right. I'm gonna make sure this door gets locked so they can't like just break in through the terrace. Well, we left the plant out, of course, but like they can't even like make it over here. They'd have to like walk on that. But I mean, better safe than sorry. Let's see, is this locked? I can't get it open, so it's locked. All right, let's do the windows. Yep, that one won't open. Just 
peach by you. That one won't open. That one won't open. And yeah, the door is locked. So let's scooch into bed. Good night, everyone. Good night. Hey, where are you going? Oh, I can't sleep. I need to go talk to somebody. I'll be back, guys. Don't say anything. Hey, George. I don't want anything to eat or drink. I just want to chat. Okay. It's about the robbery. Yeah, I can see why you want to chat. Can't sleep? Yeah. Um, excuse me, where are you two going? Oh, uh, we're just, uh, going to visit somebody. Um, you didn't sign in. I didn't think I had to. I'm visiting a friend at the house. Alright, but, um, you guys should really be getting out of here soon unless you're sleeping over because we're going to be locking up our doors. Alright. We won't be long. Okay. You too, bye. We will. Where are you two going? Uh, the first floor. Stairs here. No, there are not. That's a kind of a fire safety hazard. Yeah, we're working on it. Alright, thanks, bud. No problem. Alright. Yeah, we're trying to visit a friend and we don't really know what floor they're on. So we're just going to go up the next floor. We might just keep doing this until we find our friend. Okay, here you are. Thanks. Alright. Locked. Whoa. Look at this. We found ourselves an open door. Yeah, I think it's worth it. Let's go. Let's humongous. They gotta be rich. I'm gonna grab this TV and this clock. Oh, these look like nice golf clubs, sir. Alright, grab them. Ooh, some drinks. Ooh, a purse. And a pass to get back in here anytime we want. Sweet. It's like they're waiting for us. They left the drawer unlocked and they put all their stuff in here. We should take some of this luggage so we can hide everything we're stealing and make it look like we're just taking out some trash or something. Good idea. Alright, let's sneak out of here. Come on! The intruders! Hurry, let us on! Let us on quick! Roberto, do not let them on! What is going on? They're the robbers and they're stealing our stuff! Oh my gosh, call the police! Uh, I am. Hello everyone, I'm Mary from your local news and this is an update on the robberies at the Summer Fun Apartments. There was another one last night and we actually had a chance to interview the robbies, the people who are being robbed. Let's roll to those clips we filmed earlier. It's Mary and I'm here with Ryan and Nicole and they live in the, um, summer fun apartments and they have eight children all sets of twins and they got robbed last night so and you'll never believe how who let the robbers in and who stopped them i was told that their oldest son andrew went downstairs to go talk to george one of the workers because he could not sleep sleep because he was stressed out because of the robberies he accidentally left the door open a crack and that let the robbers in but they were all saved when their youngest son austin cried after waking up from a bad dream or something and that woke up his father which made him notice the robbers and stop them and get them arrested. All of their stuff is back safely into their home and they are living just fine now. So Andrew, how did you feel when you stopped those robbers? Uh, I felt like a hero for me, like my family and everyone else who could have potentially gotten robbed. Yeah, so 
That must have been a very scary experience, huh? Oh yeah, I really didn't know what to do. I just told Roberto, the elevator guy, to not let them on, and then I called the police, and they were here. Well, that's great to know that the enforcements could be there to save the day, as well as you. You are a local hero. Yeah, I guess you could say that. <laughs> They're a lovely family, and I'm so glad that they are safe and all of their stuff has been returned and that the crooks are in jail now. I'm Mary from your local news, and I'll see you next time. Wow, we were on the news. Yeah, but for a pretty bad reason. Well, I mean, I was a hero, as Mary said. <sighs> of course. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe. And in the comments, let us know um, if you would be scared if a robber tried to break into your house. We'll see you guys next week on Playmobil TV. Bye!